Hello, and welcome to this episode of the Clinic Marketing Podcast. I'm your host, Darcy Sullivan from Propel Marketing and Design. Today, we're diving into the world of YouTube SEO for clinic owners and healthcare providers. YouTube has become one of the most popular search engines, second only to Google. As a clinic owner, leveraging YouTube can significantly boost your online presence, drive traffic to your website, and ultimately help you grow your patient base. In this episode, we'll cover some essential YouTube SEO strategies to help you get started. After all, YouTube isn't just a platform for entertainment. It's a powerful search engine. If you optimize your YouTube videos correctly, they can drive a ton of traffic to your clinic's website, increase your brand's visibility, and even improve your rankings on Google. Now, before we dive into the strategies that we're going to cover today, Let's clear up one common misconception. Many people think that optimizing videos for Google is the same thing as optimizing them for YouTube. But here's the thing. YouTube is its own beast. It has its own ranking factors and algorithms that you need to cater to if you want your videos to succeed on that platform. So when you're working on YouTube SEO, focus on ranking within YouTube itself first. This will give you a better shot boosting your video's visibility and in turn, driving more traffic to your clinic. YouTube SEO is a powerful tool for clinic owners who want to expand their online reach. By following these strategies, you'll be well on your way to increasing your subscribers, improving your ranks, and ultimately driving more patients to your clinic. This episode is pulled from one of our most popular blog posts entitled YouTube SEO guide for clinic owners. If you look at the show notes for this episode, you'll be able to follow that step-by-step guided blog that will walk you through how to optimize for YouTube. Along with this blog post, if you visit the blog post link, which is propelyourcompany.com, slash YouTube dash SEO, or you can find the link in the show notes. You will also find a thorough, detailed guide and downloadable checklist. Again, you can find those resources by visiting the show notes or by visiting propelyourcompany.com slash YouTube dash SEO. So I took a couple key elements from those resources, and that is what I'm sharing with you today. First, let's talk about the importance of keyword research. Before you even start creating your video, you need to find the right keywords to target. Much like regular SEO, keywords play a huge role in YouTube SEO. Use YouTube-friendly keyword tools to discover what your potential patients are searching for. Again, that resource that you'll find in the show notes will give you a list of some of those research tools. You want to focus on long-tail keywords and topics related to instructional content, service reviews, or step-by-step tutorials that are in your niche. Now, let's talk about the link of videos and audience retention. So when we're talking about these YouTube videos, we're talking about longer YouTube videos. We're not talking about the shorts. We're not talking about those YouTube shorts 
that are short little tiny videos that are similar to the Instagram reels. We are talking about longer form content, content that would be over that 30 to 60 second content. YouTube favors videos that keep viewers engaged for longer periods. This makes sense, right? Like YouTube wants to show content that is going to keep people on their website longer because when people are on their website longer, they can serve them ads and they have control. So YouTube, of course, is going to favor videos that keep viewers engaged for longer periods of time. While you don't want to artificially stretch your content to aim to create extensive, comprehensive videos that don't provide quality and value, you want to remember that the longer people watch your video, the more likely YouTube is to promote it. So here's a quick tip. At the beginning of your video, provide a brief summary of what you'll cover. This not only helps viewers decide if the content is relevant to them, but also encourages to stick, get them to stick around till the end. You can do a hook. You can do one of those and wait till the end when I share with you fill in the blank. But you want to give them a reason to continue to watch your video. And again, the more in-depth tips, step-by-step guide, and checklist you can find on our website or in the show notes. On our website, you can find it by visiting propelyourcompany.com slash YouTube dash SEO. Now, let's talk about optimizing your video once it's already uploaded. Start by changing the file name to include your targeted keyword. Then you're going to want to craft a descriptive keyword-rich title that's under 60 characters. For example, if you're a chiropractor, you might use the title like Six Effective Ways to Relieve Back Pain Fast and Naturally. Your video description is critical for SEO. Make it at least 250 words long. Include your keyword in the first 25 words and use it two to four times throughout the description. Don't forget to add timestamps, links to your website, and calls to action asking viewers to subscribe to your channel. One often overlooks the feature of a transcript. By uploading a transcript, you're giving YouTube more information about your video's content, which can help with rankings. Plus, it makes your content more accessible to viewers who are deaf or hard of hearing. Audience interaction is also a significant ranking factor on YouTube. You want to encourage viewers to like, to comment, and share your video. One effective strategy is to ask easy to answer questions in your video to prompt comments. And always respond to comments personally. It builds relationships and encourages engagement. Finally, don't forget to promote your video. This is key, especially in the first 24 hours after uploading the video. Share it on your social media channels, email it to your patient base, and consider embedding it in a relative blog post on your website. Now, if you are a member of our DIY SEO program, Ready, Set, Ring, under the Ready, Set blog section, you will find a video training that we did on how to turn a simple YouTube video, just like the one we're talking about, into an SEO-friendly blog post. So if you are a member of Ready, Set, Ray, please be sure to check that video training out. It's going to help you immensely. I've seen tons of clinic owners take the content that they have from these videos and turn them into blog posts, and they are truly driving amazing traffic to their website. If you're interested in learning more about that DIY SEO program, you can visit our website, propelyourcompany.com. 
and you will find information about Ready, Set, Rank there. Now, one thing to remember when it comes to YouTube SEO is consistency is key. Key with all marketing efforts, really. But creating a content calendar and sticking to it will help you. Regular uploads signal to YouTube that your channel is active and worth promoting. Listen, we've only touched the surface in this short episode. What I want you to do is make sure that you go and that you read the blog post that we have, that you grab that free in-depth guide and checklist, and that you start taking actions to improve your YouTube SEO. That in-depth guide will include more tips on optimizing your channel, creating playlists, and using YouTube analytics. Again, you can find that link in the show notes or by visiting propelyourcompany.com slash YouTube dash SEO. That's it for today's episode. If you found this information helpful, please subscribe to our podcast and leave a review. It really helps us reach more clinic owners like you. Until next time, keep creating great content and growing your practice. Are you a chiropractor, physical therapist, acupuncturist, wellness practitioner, or other clinic owner looking to attract more patients and grow your healthcare practice? Welcome to the Clinic Marketing Podcast. Together, we'll explore topics like SEO, local search engine optimization, website design, social media marketing, content creation, helpful marketing tools, AI, and more. You'll learn how to effectively leverage these tools to increase your online visibility, engage with your target audience, and ultimately drive more traffic to your practice. From understanding the latest marketing trends to implementing best practices, we'll break down complex concepts into easy-to-understand nuggets of wisdom You'll get practical tips to help you stay ahead of the curve and outshine your competition. Get ready to unlock the secrets of successful clinic marketing. Together, let's propel your practice.